Hi guys, Mark Stowe here, Stowe's Window Cleaning. I'm going to talk to you today about this. This is the Boss Hybrid 22 water fed pole. Um, it was sent to me maybe two and a half years ago, maybe a bit longer, from Blade Riot, which is Liam Paul, with the agreement that I would receive the pole and then do a review for you guys. But to be honest, I didn't want to do one too quickly, because let's be honest, everything works well for five minutes, right? I wanted to really, really test it um, to give you a real honest review. It's so easy just to, you know, to do a review, to suck up to someone or, or some particular product. But I want to give you an honest review and I want to do Blade Right the justice they deserve. Because quite frankly, it's been a mega pole. It's only a 22, like I've said. So it's only a small one, I'm quite a small guy. I use it every day, every day, all day, unless it's for, for higher properties, then I'll get out my slightly larger pole. Um, so yeah, two and a half years I've been using this. And in that time, of course, it's not brand new. It's been worn, you know, the, the branding on the outside has been worn off and the stop marks on the pole, each individual section of the pole has been worn off. But in terms of its function, it still works really, really well. Like when I first received it. No signs of cracking or anything like that yet. So absolutely chuffed to bits with it. The only thing that I came across maybe, maybe about a year ago, roughly. So obviously we know this part of the pole can spin when it's closed. And obviously you can just adjust it like you do every pole, right? But I found over time, so probably about 18 months of, of daily use, this part was moving on this part of the pole. So I thought, okay, maybe it's now time for the version two clamps. So the guys at Blade Right sent me out the version two clamps and I was gonna fit them. I was literally in the process of fitting them and I took the clamp off. I was like, hmm, there's nothing in between the clamp and the pole. And what I mean by that is like, going back to my automotive days, when you'd want something to fit tightly or create a nice seal, you'd have some sort of gasket or washer or something. I was like, I'm gonna try something before I put the V2 clamps on. So I literally just got some like black insulation tape. I did, took the clamp off, did one loop, around the pole, I didn't overlap the ta tape at all. And then just put the clamp back on. That was a year ago, if not longer, and it still <laughs> works perfectly fine. Because my thinking was, well if it just wears out after a month, just replace the tape and off you go. But it still works, I haven't replaced any of the tape on any of the clamp sections. So I'm super, super chuffed with that little um, modification, would you like? Just but for me, it felt like there should be something there because there would be on, on any other thing else you would sort of create. So that is a thorough test of this particular product and I cannot rate it enough. I've had other poles in the past that after about six months to a year start to get a little bit tired somewhat, but this has just been bang on and I'm using it every day, all day apart from the high jobs. So quick shout out to the guys down at Blade Riot. Thank you very much for this. It's uh, gonna do me a few more years yet. And uh, anyone thinking about getting a boss pole or already have one, let me know in the comments down below. Until next time, I'll speak to you very soon. Take care.